like I said, before you open up your mouth and speak, before you open up your door and step into your house, before you do anything, you need to calculate, you know, the, the type of shit. It, it's, it goes deeper than what people are, are willing to, to really grasp. Like I said, when you wake up in the morning, you want to visualize specific shit. Before you even step out of your bed, you're visualizing specific shit, and you're moving through, you know, like a, a you know, like a plan. Like you have the plans. Before you go build something, you need to have plans. So you know, this goes here and this goes here. If you don't have any real plans. You don't know where you're going. You don't know where you came from. You, you can't possibly know where you're going if you don't know where you came from. So mm -hmm. once you start to realize that it does matter that if you do plan it up properly, you won't smash your pinky toe on this. You know what I mean? Because you will go. Yeah. Yeah. You, you, one thing is, shit happens when you're not all together there, right? You're not yeah. all together yeah. there and thinking out shit properly. You're not. That's true. You're, you're doing stupid shit. You're, you get pulled over by a cop. You get arrested for DUI. Whatever it is that you do off this, this plan that you're supposed to keep, you know, shit starts to happen. So. That's like leaving your house without breakfast. Like, you're still kind of in the blueprint, like, mentally. So it's easy for, like, shit to get fucked up. I mean, unless you had already planned in your head to have the breakfast outside of the house you know, to meet somebody. What I'm saying is that mm -hmm. maybe breakfast might be a good example. What I'm saying is, you know, at some point you realize that, that, you're, that this is a game. This, this whole reality is matrix, that everything... Is calculated. You don't think to calculate shit, but people will literally step out of their doors and shit will fall on their head. People will step out into a street and a bus will smash them because they just didn't look up and to what direction? Left and that and right before they did what? Cross the street. Their mother told them, make sure you look what? Left and right before they And then you grow up and I hear you get hit by a fucking bus because you're, you're not fucking stupid. It's like, you know. You know your boss needs you at work there tomorrow morning early, but you're going to go out there and get drunk tonight and do blow and all kinds of other shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's what people do. They, for whatever reason, whatever those vices are that gets them off that path, you know, of doing what's right. You know, I know you might go to work and see a hot, like you have your wife, and then you go to work and you might see a hot chick, and you might want to do that hot chick, but you know, it's, you know that's the wrong thing to do. You're in a relationship with somebody. Before you would do that, you, you've got to know that if you even go in that direction, how do you not see your whole world's going to fall apart? Yeah. How many people yet? You're going to be on that show Cheaters and shit or something like that. You're going to be all over TV plastic. Yeah. But what I'm saying is that how do you not, not how do people not see that? It, mm -hmm. It's like it's like they're, they played themselves. If you didn't do your homework last night, when you get to school tomorrow morning, your teacher is going to be like, what the fuck? And, and it's day after day after day after day. Because you got to do your Minecraft gaming or whatever it is that children do these days that stops them from doing this. What to an adult now is like baby shit, right? You see their homework and you're like, oh, baby, I remember. <laughs> you know, to think that they could just knock out their homework quickly or something like that. It was, that it was, it's, it's a dis it's a distraction, so like snowball, and then it's a when you become self. Oh, I'll say, it. I'm self aware. I can I know where I go, where I'm going. I know where I came from. I'm self aware. Like I calculate the shit I'm gonna do each day, the steps that I'm gonna make, so I don't jam my toe with. I don't spill my this or the thing is that you know I, I'm calculating for the benefit of all, and I'm like a machine now. You know, I put my blood into the machine, and now you know I'm. I'm moving like, mm -hmm. you know, you're connected. You know, like, you're like you're heard alive. of like artificial intelligence? That's fun. That's, that's like fun. Artificial intelligence. I mean, I'm self-aware. Artificial intelligence, even if it was so mythically powered, it couldn't stop me from taking over the universe. Not, not, not Superman. Not your, your, your demons, your angels, or your gods, whatever. You see what I'm saying? It's it's not. It, it's it's kind of funny. So I think. We should probably end this this video on this type of note. That once you get done, you know, the next you might not open up your mouth until the next person speaks to you first, and they ask you something. Otherwise, you know, 
you're on your path and nobody's in your way, nobody's bothering you. You know, I don't really talk to anybody unless I'm spoken to and they, they draw something out of me. Like, you draw a video out of me, you know, don't even bother talking to me because you know, it's like nobody has anything of value to say to me. I don't even want to talk to them. If, if, you see what I'm saying? It's like I've, I've, I've isolated myself from the retorts. It's like, no, I mean, I know how bad it really is. It's like, I don't mean to be a dick. It's not like, but once it, it sinks in, this knowledge, and you realize you can't tell. Who are you going to tell? All you can do is make videos. You can run around yeah. doing like what I do. But I don't think you have the balls to get over the humps that I can get over. Like, like when somebody laughs at me, I say, you're a fucking retard. You can't even fucking look it up. You got a cell phone in your hand. You can't even type in this shit and do a fucking watch a video or something. You know, they don't want to to know the truth. They prefer to cling to their retardation. And when I see that, I will slam it there. You're going to cling to your fucking retardation? You tell me you can't do this, this, and this, and this? Do I look like I'm a joke to you? You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I mean, the way I slam it down their fucking throat in, in the right way makes them take action where they do look it up and now what I'm saying is that the people that I work around with are so far advanced now for them to talk to other people about it they they can see how crazy it might seem because they've, they've come so far in the short time that I've worked with them beating this shit down while I'm in the truck with them or working on the job and doing reversals this type of thing you know I've been at this for a while now and getting away with it for, for other people try it this could be kind of shocking yeah if you to go and try and tell your boss this type of shit, you'd probably get fired. If I was told my boss that, and I was fired, I would go to the next company over and get higher pay and tell them I was being overworked and underpaid and be in a new company shirt in a fucking minute. You know what I'm saying? And in a new fucking whatever, in a minute. It's I don't worry about being fired or anything like that. I got videos showing all of my fucking, my resume is so big now, it's like, Doctor's offices in my videos, dental offices, million dollar homes. I could actually pull up the videos on YouTube and say, look, 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 look. You know, this is what's happened. You on your job, you might be, I don't know, maybe you're in healthcare or you're in this or that. There's, it's not something that you could videotape and cling to and then use this evidence that you have to go to the next job and get higher pay. It's like, I know what my value is if you look it up. Look, plumbers' apprentices make fifty thousand dollars a year just to be an apprentice. Look it up. Mm -hmm. You get tools and everything like that. Look it up on your computer. I want to be a plumbing apprentice in New York. You get fifty thousand dollars to go to school. They give you tools. They give you charge. You everything to to be the apprentice. And then when you're done, they 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 pay you this ridiculous amount because there's a shortage of trade. And what I'm saying to you is that you know if anybody could do this is it just, your brain hasn't put these little pieces together that if you're going to a place every day and doing some work, like a before and after, you started the day at a job and there was no sales, and now at the end of the day, you can take a picture of the sheet that said there was no sales. Now, look at all the sales I did by the end of the day, sitting in the desk on the phone, you, you made a video. That, what, what are you doing today? Here's the script that I was using on the phone, selling this, timeshares, or how to get out of your timeshare, or, or whatever it is that, that people have to do for their day. I'm saying got to the job before there was any work done you might have snapped that there was zero things in the in the tray and now at the end of the day you got all these sales slips there and all these checks over here and that there's progress every day that you could take and show to someone else in the same type of thing that you use as a stepping stone you say it's not like you need a reference from somebody. You've got all the proof right there. It's like, I don't need a reference. This is all the shit I did. I got the bones on me. I did that fucking soldering over there. I did that over there. I, I, you, you see what I'm saying? It's not, it's, it's not something that, it, that somebody can finagle out of your hands. Once it, it becomes tangible to you, like, I know I have tangible skills. If you want to make money, you need to learn to trade. Something, again, people are not going to fix their own plumbing. They're not going to fix their own icing. And they're not going to fix their own electric. I, I assure you, people don't even want to cook their own fucking food. Tell them. So, they have this trade, like, I can cook. I'm a chef, you know what I mean? Everybody wants to have a good cook. Who doesn't want to have a nice cook, you know what I mean? It's a butcher, a baker, a candlestick maker. When was the last time you made a fucking candle? When was the last time you butchered something? I mean, you, you have to have something that you can attach to that 
that, that held some intrinsic value. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Or a company's going to put you in a truck and give you all this shit because they know you have the skill to go to that place, get the job done, and come back with a slip that they can mail a bill to you. You see what I'm saying? It's that you either have that power or you don't. You could suck at sales. I told you, law of average is one in ten. You could suck at sales. One out of every ten people is gonna say yes. To you. So if you're going door to door selling shit, you better be knocking at more doors than everybody else, calling more people. Every it's see more people, see more people. That's what sales is all about. It, it, that's not what like what I'm in is all about. It's not about see more people. It's about go to a job, spend the whole day there, get the shit done. It's, it's, it's not the same type of thing. So. I'm just trying to give some people power out here. I know mm -hmm. so many people like right on the edge of to jump forward in, in something that you're doing, whether it be your relationship, job, your religious belief, or something. You're, some of you are like on the edge. You, you still think I'm crazy about something, but it, it, it's going to sink in. And when it tips over, then you're going to go to the next level. Like every time we do a video, we, we go to the next level. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. 